I hope you're all well and I hope you're all doing amazing welcome 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 back guys so um, as you can tell by the title of this video um, this video is just me doing a what's in my bag and this one is gonna be a travel edition so um, without further ado we just jump right straight into this video because I didn't want it to take too long so I'm just going to show you guys um, what I always take along with me you know whenever I'm traveling um, so yeah so without wasting much time let me show you guys what I've got in my travel handbag so here um, is the bag so um, first of all um, I am going to show you guys what I've got in my travel handbag and also I am going to just um, do a review of this bag right here which I'm going to do at the end of this video so um, this is my handbag it's just a cross um, body bag that's what it looks like um, so let's start by let me just show you so that's pretty much everything i've got in there so the first item um that i've got in my bag is a book so i do not um carry um a book to read all the time that i travel but the street that i'm on um i did take um one of my books and this one is um it's called you are a badass at making money <laughs> So this one is by Jen Cicero. I don't know if I'm pronouncing the name well, but it says Jen Cicero. So that's what it looks like. So I've got that with me on this trip. So that's the first item um, you would find in my bag. So let's just put that on the side. Okay, so the other item you would find in my bag is a hand sanitizer and this one this is what it looks like i always carry like the small ones with me um so this one is from sagota and i used to pick this up from dm um it's uh what's it called it's like um super drug store if i must say so it's similar to super drug in the uk so it's called dm in germany so um i used to buy the small ones um there and it's called sagaton they do have like uh, minis you know travel um size of um this hand sanitizer so when i buy them i always reuse the bottle so this is a refill basically so i would have my hand sanitizer so that's the second item you would find in my bag so now the next item is I know this looks like a little bit like okay what's this <laughs> so this is my bible so um I know um it might sound a bit weird to some of you guys but every time I travel I always travel with my bible don't ask me why please <laughs> but I always always travel with my bible I try to make sure it's not in my checked in luggage I try to make sure that it's in my um either my cabin um luggage or my um handbag if I do have like a mini handbag like this so so I always take my Bible with me. Mm -hmm. um, if you want to know why, message me <laughs> and then I'll tell you why. But that's the number three item you would find in my travel handbag. So let's put that aside. So the other item you would find is we have this right here. And this is just, you know, um, what's it called? A hand -took. Um, as we would call it here in Germany and you know, the ones you can carry along just in case you need it you know anytime and any day so yeah that's number four item you will find in my bag so the next item is my airports um, so yeah it's just the mini um, airport pro and yeah um, nothing too serious and um, just the airport uh, mini um, airport mini i don't know if it's called airport mini but yeah the airport um pro so you would find that in my bag the next item you would find in my bag is obviously a face mask so you would find this in my bag this is just um a regular um face mask that i always have with me so when i purchased this it came like in three packs from um adidas um website 
so um which is really good you know obviously you can always wash them and this you can i like to do hand wash instead of wash them in the wash machine because um it gets cleaned properly when you wash them with your hands so they're really good and you get like three of this in a pack when you order them so yeah i always have this so if i don't have um that mask i would always um travel with this one right here so this one right here um i would always travel with that and then just take like one um one of it and then put it together with this because sometimes they do not allow um you know this you know normal mask they allow like um this ffp2 kind of mask so that's what it looks like especially on um some of um german airlines so they usually request this one so if i don't have that one i would always have one of this and just have the whole pack in my luggage next item that you would find in my bag is my lip balm which is just this one right here so this one is the vaseline um lip balm i've had this for a while so usually because obviously you can use the whole of this vaseline uh, because it's just a lot in it so um when i see it's been a while that i've had it i just always replace it to be honest you can't really use it all so you would always have to like just change it we're almost approaching winter so you would definitely definitely need this in your bag so you would always find this in my bag so the final thing um that you would find in my travel bag is the major thing which is obviously um passport so that's what uh, my passport looks like so you would always find this in my travel handbag nothing much to say about this just you know my passport basically yeah so that's it so that's that for everything you would find in my travel handbag so i always have like my small mini bag with me anyway to be able to put all of these things in there so most of those things you would always find in my travel handbag but the only thing that i would say that you would obviously not see every time that i travel would be a book you know if i don't have it in my small bag obviously it was because that was able to fit that's why i was able to put it in my bag but if it wasn't fitting i would just check it in and my other bag but sometimes i travel with the book and sometimes i don't so it just all depends on my mood um so yeah that's the first part of this video just all the items you'll find in my travel handbag so now to the other part of this video um which is a bag review so i'm going to be doing a bag review for you guys so this is the micro cause jade grosset cross body bag i'm hoping i'm pronouncing that well but i'm going to leave the name of the bag on the screen so this is what it looks like and that's the side and that's the back and that's the other side so this right here is my baby girl <laughs> so in terms of like luxury item i'm not like you know crazy about it but what i do is every year so for my birthday i like to just gift myself one at least one luxury item not even at least i think it's just one you know that obviously i can afford and then i just try to give myself one luxury item and this was just one of them i'm going to try and insert a picture of when i was unboxing it so i think i got this like two years ago i'm not precisely sure but if it's not three years ago it would definitely be two years ago so i did order this um online from here in germany because usually around christmas time which is my birthday i'm always um back in germany to spend the time with my family so that was the time that i got this at the time and um i really fell in love with this and you can also get this from um michael Kors website um here in germany or in the uk or elsewhere whichever online store that you um, shop when it comes to your luxury item so these they have it in this color which is brown and obviously the nude and um, but they do also have it in um, olive and nude as well so um I really like it because um it's just my color is my kind of color is really cool you know it's tan it's brown and yeah that's what the front looks like and this is what the inside looks like as well so it's got the brown leather um detailing as well going on in there and i really like the fact that it's got a lot of compartments which is crazy for a mini crossbody bag and the first one obviously that you can see is this one right here 
so it's got this small one right here so it's got this small part right there and then obviously you can put your stuff in it and this is just um, a card from a restaurant that I went to this Italian restaurant from Manchester so it's been in my bag um, since then so I'm just gonna put that on the side but obviously and um, that's what the inside looks like so it's got that first compartment and then it's got here as well I hope you guys can see so it's got that and then you've got like the sides to read as well where you can put um, your cards and you know just anything like that you can put it right there and also it's got the space it's got another um, part to it as well there so and then you can zip that and then it's got this part as well and then it's got this part as well which is here so which is really crazy like it's got so many parts to it and you can fit in as many items as you want to so that's the inside that's what the inside looks like it's just got like a satin um layered um finishing in the inside and um yeah and i really like the gold detailing as well so let me tell you guys so when i did um obviously unboxed this bag um you could tell that the finishing was so properly done like if you check the details right there you would see that they really really um did it so well in terms of obviously the um making and everything like that so on the back this is what the back looks like and you have another compartment as well you have this part away and it's got the click as well um to obviously um close it right there and yeah so and for the handle it's got this gold um detailing um to it and it's got um the leather straps as well so gold and just this small leather strap to it and it's very nice so you can always um have it this way just like that you can have it this way and you can also have it the other way which is like this as well just right there like that and that's what the bottom looks like right there it's a very pretty bag and i would say um for the price that you pay for this i think it's worth it um it's not overly pricey and it's just you know i feel like for a luxury item as good as well made as this i think is very affordable i wouldn't say very very affordable but i think obviously like for um a crossbody bag like this i think it's worth the price you pay for it so um yeah so that's just it so like i said it's called the michael cause jade grosset bag let me just double check that on my phone just to be sure so um it says is leather it's coated canvas is lining which is polyester and um i don't know if you guys are interested in the dimension it just says 16.5 for the height and it says for the for the width is 22.5 centimeter and for the depth um which i think is the d is 7.5 centimeter so that's just the details that i do have on here let me see if there's any other information that i can see yeah so it's called the michael cause women's jade gusset shoulder bag and this one is the color brown yeah so that's what it looks like and obviously it does have um its um, name right there on this part and it does have it right here as well right on the side and it also has it like just you know right right there just a little bit on this side if you guys can see it so that's what it looks like and that's it right there i've always wanted to do like a review of this bag you know in a while but i feel like this is the perfect time to do it so yeah that is that for uh, this video so i hope you enjoyed it by the way before i go i do want to say that i do have a travel vlog coming up because i'm on holiday and i'm super excited that i am going away so um, um please do check out the vlog when it does come up i'm currently in germany 
um, spending the few days with my family so we are all going to be traveling together so please look out for the vlog and um, I will be obviously traveling tomorrow so I will be taking you guys along with me in the vlog so please do check it out when it does come up and yeah so that will be that for this video please do leave me a comment down below let me know what you think about the bag and also um, let me know what is um, a luxury item for you if you're looking to get anything for yourself this year and yeah just let me know in the comment section below and yeah thank you guys so much for joining me today and yeah i will see you all in my next video until then stay blessed bye